Hello, everybody, and welcome <laughs> to probably a cringy little video. Um, I'm gonna be playing Poppy Playtime today, and if you don't know what Poppy Playtime is, have you actually been on the internet in the last six-ish months? But, um, if you have, then you probably know that Poppy Playtime is a... Well, it's branded as a horror game, but most creators would not agree that it's a horror game unless you're about three years old. And even then, still, it may have some creepy undertones, like the fact that it's in an abandoned factory, but it doesn't matter. Anyway, uh, this is going to be my first time playing the game. Uh, so, yeah. Enjoy. I have already seen the opening cutscene, but for the video, I'll watch it again. You are about to see the most incredible doll ever invented. Her name is Poppy, and she is the first truly intelligent doll in the world. This guy's creepy. A little girl can talk to her. Poppy gives her answers. She is the first doll actually able to have a conversation with a child. Hard to believe? Just watch. Poppy Playtime! Poppy Playtime. Poppy as a real girl, and she talks like one, too. Hi, my name is Poppy. I love you. Can you help me polish my shoes? Yeah. Why, of course, Poppy. I would not buy That's the Poppy like Playtime doll. Poppy always wants to look her best. What is that sun in the background? Dirty and won't come out when you brush it. And smells just like a poppy flower. Is there anything else you'd like to say, Poppy? I'm a real girl. Just like you. What's the time? Here's my theory. Okay, my theory is that the poppy doll is actually a child. Like, the companion cube from Portal is actually somebody dismembered and stuffed into a cube. Okay, I do not want to go through that doorway. I already know I will have to, because... Why else would it show it? Uh, yeah, I'm hoping that this isn't too terrible. I'm also hoping that chapter one isn't too long, so I can do it in one video instead of break it up into multiple videos, but, you know, what's the worst that could happen? In fact, that actually may improve viewership, so I may do that anyway, but... <laughs> okay, loading. All right, so walking in, I can already see that this factory is freaking creepy. Uh, little box. What does that box say? Boogie Bot. Cool. Sounds like a toy I would buy. What's this? Can't interact with it, so let's. What is this? Okay. So, right off the bat, I'm noticing I can't really interact with anything. Okay, that almost... Okay. Poppy wants to play. Yeah, that's not creepy at all. That's definitely how you do your marketing so that kids want to buy your stuff. Um... Yeah. Okay. So, who knows, maybe Playtime Co. was just a normal toy company and they just are really bad at marketing. It, it, it's a possibility. Okay, that, uh, I pressed tab. Oh, item. I have that item, okay. Oh, crap. Okay, so. Hi. My name is Leif Pierre, and I'm the head of innovation here at the Playtime Co. Toy Factory. Okay. If you're seeing this, then you're trespassing. Yeah, we play this little tape on loop whenever we close the factory for the day. So, trespasser, just to make you aware, while we pride ourselves primarily on our high-quality toys and excellent childcare, we also pride ourselves on our security. For example... 
Uh -oh. Facility is full of hidden motion triggers, which, once set off, will turn on the factory's emergency alarms and directly contact the authorities. And uh oh. That's one of the more tame aspects of our security system. Oh. Um, no spoilers. So, you've got my Pierre? word. Pierre? It's not too late to turn around. I just hope that you're certain whatever you're doing is worth it. Uh, Pierre, I'm sorry. I want to get out. Let me out. Let me out. Okay, fine, fine, fine. It's all fine. Nothing bad can happen to me here. Right. Okay, so, uh, Pierre, you seem like a... What is that sound? Pierre, what you doing, man? Is that you? Also, I don't know if it's the monitor, but the game looks incredibly dark to me. So I'm going to turn up the brightness just a little bit. Just a little bit. Okay, much less creepy, and I can actually tell what's going on now. Okay, good. I thought that was someone breathing. That's just a train. We're all good. Boogie bot. Um... Buddy, you're a, you're a robot. Why well, you got some blood? All right, you know what? No, it's fine. So, boogie bot, I guess failed. Anyway, I'm gonna get out of here because I'm kind of, frankly, terrified of this place, and I want to leave. I want to go home. Um. Okay, so I don't know the code. And I don't know if I want to know the code. What is that? I don't think I want to know the code. Pierre, I want to get out. Pierre? Buddy? Okay, um. Okay. You know, it's fine. I'll just go through here. Oh, a dismembered baby doll. That's not creepy at all. Okay, so. Obviously, nothing can happen here because it's just an abandoned toy factory. The only reason it's creepy is because it's a liminal space. There's nobody here. It's been abandoned for years. Nobody knows why it's abandoned. At least I don't, and I wish I did. But it's fine. It's fine. I'll, I'll be fine. Everything here is fine. Hopefully. Candy cat. That sounds fun. What is this? Okay, so... So I can just walk through broken glass, apparently. I am apparently superhuman. Um... Playtime Co. Welcome. Okay, so... I guess I'm supposed to figure out the code. Maybe it's red, blue, yellow, yellow. Okay, so... Um... I guess I'll just keep walking through this incredibly creepy factory. Uh. I want out. Let me out. Okay. So, you know, it's fine. I'll, I'll just go into the gift shop. Everything will be fine. I'll just keep looking in here until I find something. This creepy freaking train get down there's secured cameras okay um yeah I'm trespassing I don't know why I'm here I don't remember even entering this place I just remember clicking a few buttons and then I appeared here I'll be fine though it's fine everything will be fine I hope um so yeah I don't really know what to do and I don't know where I am I don't even know who I am and man that blue fuzzy guy looks so friendly. 
I sure hope he doesn't try to kill us. How could such a friendly guy want to kill us anyway? It will be fine, man. <laughs> so friendly. Everything is good. Life is good. Um, his arms are a little long, though. That's a bit unsettling. Um, okay, so... I don't really see any colors or anything. Like, I see three colors. There's no white on here, so, like... I see three colors on the floor. So, I guess... Red, blue, yellow, gray? Oh, that is white. Okay. Okay. So... I guess... Really, now I just need to figure something out. Also, what is with all these, like, old abandoned toys just sitting dead on the ground? Like, I know it's a toy factory, but why has it got to be so creepy? Okay. So, I actually have no idea what the code is or anything like I'm confused genuinely confused right now um I've seen playthroughs of the, of the beginning of the game but I do not remember very much okay let's try I don't know it's got to be some combination of these three colors or four colors I mean Oh, red, yellow, pink, green. Sometimes the creepiest things. Red, yellow, pink, green. Whoops. Okay. 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 We got in here. Uh, a million CRT monitors. Not terrifying at all. But what? You know what? No. Okay. Playtime Co. The grab pack. Ah, yes. Tighten the straps. Hold both cannons. Pull trigger to fire. Pull again to retract. Hold to grip onto objects. Only fire at small objects slash handles. Do not fire at a coworker. This may cause injury. <laughs> <laughs> Wire is conductive, used for rewiring. Okay. Thank you. What's the time? Playtime. Okay, so... Um, I guess we'll go to this little hand thing. Turn on this. Oh! That sound effect is terrible. Oh! Hi, Huggy. Um. 
Welcome to Playtime Co. Hi, Huggy. Haha, <laughs> I get hit. Haha, <laughs> you got hit. Haha, <laughs> that must hurt. What? Why would- Okay, see, this is probably a completely normal company, but their marketing is terrible. Don't tell a little kid that their new toy that they got for Christmas is gonna squeeze them until they pop. That is not good marketing! Does these people know anything about marketing? I do not think so. No, sir. Stop, employees only. Ha, I slapped you. Ha, I get wrecked. Ha, 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 ha. Yeah, that's terrible marketing. Like, <laughs> just saying, if I was a kid, I would not really want any of the toys from this terrible place. Um, but anyway. What was that? Also, what is this on the floor? I'm just gonna assume it's dirt. Like. Also, what f uh... Well, um. Okay. Um, something tells me I really don't want to go in here. Huh. Okay. So, uh, dirty toy in the floor. We're just gonna assume that's dirt. Um, they need to repaint. But other than that, this is just a perfectly normal liminal space. Perfectly normal. Nothing wrong could ever happen here, right? I'm, I'm just gonna assume that nothing bad has ever or will ever happen in this factory. Because it's just a toy factory, right? Do be kind to others, show up on time, and do not hide behind doors to scare Lath Pierre. And don't stay past 8 p.m., misuse company time, tamper with machinery, or enter Innovation Wing without authorization. Now I want to do all of those things. Actually, no, I don't. I don't think I actually do. Um, also, man, are we going to talk about this guy's knees? Like, he can crouch so low to the ground. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't think we really want to go in there. So let's just keep walking through here what's that you know what there's probably absolutely nothing to see here also for some reason my monitor just got like brighter so I guess I'll turn the brightness back down to default All right it's completely fine now it is now a million times creepier in here though so Also, I should probably be pretty creepy. I mean, uh, pretty careful. Lest I get electrocuted. Okay, that sounded good. That Dude, my monitor just dimmed like crazy again. I, for real, can't really tell what's going on. But, uh... You know what, because my monitor is so dim, I will just turn up the brightness a tiny bit. As much as I would love to play the game exactly how it was intended, sometimes having a... Oh, nope. Nope. I'm just gonna hide in this corner. Uh. <laughs> oh no. Huggy? <laughs> Huggy? 
Buddy? Hey, buddy. Um, so I'm just gonna assume the worst. Huggy Wuggies escaped, and we're screwed. Uh, make, make a friend? I'm just gonna assume that's where, like, there's lots of kids here. Oh, nope, nope, I'm out of here. Nope. Huggy, was that you? <laughs> if you're lonely, just say something. Maybe we could be friends. Uh-uh, no. Mm-mm, mm-mm, no, sir. No, sir, <laughs> mm -mm. Stairway to hell, and it's locked. I need out, ah! Okay. You know what? It's fine. Caution, do not enter. Uh-uh. Uh uh-uh. It's so dark. Oh! <laughs> okay. These people need to, uh, make their... Make their, uh, factory a little bit less creepy. Mm-mm, nah. Mm-mm, no, man. No, sir. Oh, that's nice. Look, he's playing a song. Um, I should actually probably stay out of those boxes. I don't know what's in them. Could be brown recluses over there. Um, somebody broke the handle off this door, so I can't even escape if I wanted to. And, uh, I need another VHS, but, you know, it... What's this? I got a new thing. Okay, so I don't really want to jump down there. Huggy says remember to take breaks. <laughs> um Uh okay, I guess I have no choice. Handle with care. Yeah. Oh. Try. Um What's with all the dismembered baby dolls? Like sort of a little bit creepy but you know this place has been abandoned for a while it's not like they can really do anything about it all right now I can get back into there and absolutely nothing bad will ever happen And now I have another one of those things. And I have a VHS, so let's see. Who knows what's on, or what's on it. Probably nothing, right? Rich, where are they keeping the Huggy boxes? I don't know. I couldn't tell you. What? Remember when maintenance left in a sweep of this place? No. Exactly. Nobody in this stupid company knows what they're doing. Oh, I swear, I haven't seen a single box in its place since they started flooding the storehouse with orphanage junk. Right. I get it. It's a nice program and all on brand. <sighs> Just hard to be happy about it with manufacturing's on our necks about it, because we can't buy stupid hockey boxes! Rich. <sighs> You're right. You're right. It's... It's for the orphans. I just wish there were less boxes. Anything. Who's talking? Is that even a word? A bit of a... 
Okay. So... Rich seems like a nice guy. He just gets mad at his job. Absolutely nothing wrong with being upset. Perfectly normal. Uh... Um... Yeah, so... So, uh... This Rich, he seems, uh... Seems like the kind of guy who would stand up for what he cares about, so if the factory's having some stupid rules and stuff, maybe... Maybe he could stop them. I don't know. Also, what is that music playing in the background? Probably nothing, you know? Probably absolutely nothing. What is that box? Okay, so... Okay, so I guess... I guess I'll go back up there. Uh... I just want to get out of this place, man. Right, where's the green one? What is that noise? Okay, um... You know what, this factory seems completely normal. Nothing could ever bad happen. Absolutely nothing bad will ever happen here, I bet. I bet you that is probably hopefully true. But even if something bad does ever happen here, it won't happen to me, right? Nothing bad will ever happen. As long as I'm here, right? Why is there just an eyeball floating? What is going on? You know, I don't think that's part of the intended game, so, um... And now I can't jump. Uh... Um, I literally cannot jump. A am I crazy? Could I jump before? Oh, now I can jump again. Okay. I knew I could jump. I'm not crazy. Where is that last green thing? It's gotta be here somewhere. How am I not falling down? <coughs> okay, so... Can I go over here and take a bit of a look around? I have literally not seen a single green thing. Like, where could it possibly be? Am I just really dumb? You know what, maybe I should try... 
Oh, because I need the, the red hand. I don't know where that is. Shout out to whoever's playing this music, though. It's pretty good. Ah. Okay, I just want to get out of this creepy place. Dude, the monitor literally just lit up again. You know, I'm gonna play at default brightness even if it's really, really dark. Okay. Hey, look, it's red. Nice. All right, now I can go through here. Um, what if I want to go back up? Oh, yeah. Okay. Uh, so I'm actually kind of confused right now, but I think. Oh. Okay. Um. Looks like we are going up. I guess. Uh uh. Uh uh. Nope. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. No, sorry. <laughs> no, no, no. I don't like this at all. Can I get out? Nobody leaves without a toy. Can I leave without a toy? Bass boosted Minecraft sound and music right there. Oh. Okay, so I guess it's up to us to figure out what's going on here. Even though I'd much rather just leave. It sounds a little bit less terrifying. I'd be completely happy just leaving. You know? Yeah. So I guess I'm going up these stairs. Let's just pretend that's rust. I don't really want to think about what happened before I came here.
Um. Okay. That was weird. Let's see, what could I do? Hmm, maybe if I... go over there. Then I can... Oh, wait. Okay. So now if I... Then I can... <laughs> okay, so... These levers still don't work. Are these baby doll body parts? Oh, they're body parts of a stuffed animal. And I'm- it's like Build-A-Bear, but creepy. So I'm literally using stuffed animal body parts, putting in this giant machine, and then making a new friend. I think I'd rather not. But, uh, thanks for the offer, I guess. It sounds like it's coming from over there. Strong tattletale vibes. Okay, so now what? Mm -hmm, no, sir. Oh, 
All right, well, that's not too bad, I guess. Stairway to hell. Oh no, sir. Poppy, poppy. Huggy, can you not? Huggy, wuggy, huggy, no, no. Oh no, huggy. 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 Innovation is key. Thank you, science. Okay. Okay. Not going in there. <laughs> Um, but so, uh, yeah. Mm -mm, no, mm -mm, not again. I gotta get the frick out of here. I can't have Huggy Wuggy eat me. <laughs> I can hear him right behind me. Oh no! I landed up right where I was again. Oh, oh. Okay. Huggy Wuggy's right behind me! Mm -mm. No, sir. Huggy Wuggy. Oh, no! Huggy Wuggy. Okay, well, I got further than I did the first time. Okay. I told you, this place is terrible with their marketing. They're marketing this big toy to children that eats your face off. Mm mm. No. Nope. Huggy is literally right behind me. What do I do? Ah! Okay. So this. This is a pretty difficult puzzle. Hmm. Okay. I have an idea. I have an idea, and it's so stupid that it may just work. What if I just... Oh wait, no I can't just run through there, that's where probably play co um, comes from. Also, um, if they're a toy company, why do they make a giant toy with big spiky teeth that comes to eat you? It's pretty stupid. Oh my gosh, I just saw Poppy. Or Huggy, I mean.
Okay. I need to get... Oh, no! Wait, let me through, let me through. Yes, 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 yes. He's gone. Ah, Huggy Wuggy is gone. Okay. Okay. Huggy Wuggy is gone. He's dead. There's no way he survived that fall. No way he survived. But now what? I don't want to go in there. Uh-uh, I don't want to go in there. That looks a little bit too creepy for my tastes. Am I supposed to have... No, I have nothing. Oh. Okay. Is Huggy there? <gasps> Huggy got him. Okay, you know what? Um, I don't want to go through there. That doesn't look very safe. But there's nowhere else to go. You know what? Fine. I'm brave. Who hung these toys? What? Am I in the back rooms? Mm -mm, no, sir. <laughs> okay. Huggy. Poppy? Anybody? Hello? Am I? Uh uh, nope. Okay, fine. Oh no, Poppy, you opened my case, Poppy. What? It's over?
guys. I think this means I have to buy chapter two. <laughs> that was unbelievably fun, actually. That was... That was quite fun. Um, the only thing is... I... I'm kind of worried about Poppy coming back, or Huggy coming back, and also, Poppy's creepy. Well, I, I guess that's it for the video. Um, I, I guess to the, like, five people who watched, if you watched to the end, thanks um don't forget to like and subscribe if you enjoyed it and uh i guess i'll see you again next time